Hi friends, it's Allison. Welcome back to AJ's Inspired Life. Welcome to my desk. This is the current state of it. I have you off the tripod for right now. I'm going to try and get a shot. I'm going to go through and de-stash this room, you guys. And this is one drawer of my planners. Um, I mean, it's, it's deep. Now, some of these you've seen and we go through a lot and some of them we haven't seen for a while. But I, um, yeah, my word of the year is release. And I got knocked off my feet at the beginning of the year. And um, it's now September. And so we're going <laughs> to... We're going to try and release some of this stash because I don't need it. Don't use it. Yes, I could, but no, I probably won't. So let me get you up here in our normal place, which is like a horrible view uh, because it's so high. That's like how high. Okay. There's a little bit better. My goodness. Okay. Holy cow. Okay. Wow. All right, let's talk about what's in this drawer. This is one drawer. I have two in that cupboard, and I think I will do both of them with you. So very quickly, I have a bag over here and a basket over here. Oh, I don't have a third pile place, do I? <laughs> All right, I'll move some stuff for a temporary solution here. Um, I need a place, obviously, for my keep pile because it's not all going. Let's, I mean, you know, let's be fair. Um, yeah, I have so many little journals, like here's a little gem that's not in the pile. Um, this was a gift and here is another little gem that, uh, I found and I've been wanting to try a weekly. Yeah, there you go. Too beautiful. We're, we're keeping those. Those weren't even in the pile to start with. Okay. I have a bag of like thrift store and I have a basket over here to like sell if you will I'm not too sure what that means so um, part of what has really been a block for me is that I don't know how to get rid of this stuff like I don't want to give it all away to the thrift store I just don't and so I am looking for the best way to maybe sell it maybe that's through like a Facebook group which is where I bought some of these um, I just don't know or if that's eBay or Mercury or whatever. I don't even know. So that's what I have. We're going to make three piles, thrift, keep, and possibly sell, possibly try to find an actual home, right? Okay. So let's just go through things. Now, <laughs> if you watch my planner video, I'm really, really wanting to move into a personal size ring binder. Um, this is a divider for that, but I'm not going to use this. So that's beautiful in the giveaway. Uh, here's a plastic sleeve for, um, you know, a traveler's notebook. And I am not ready to make that decision. So for right now, it's going in keep because I don't know what size. I don't know what we're doing. This is, uh, gosh, I love this thing. And I actually got this at a thrift store. Um, we, we use this frequently and... The most recent is my um, challenge. This is just a, a notebook, it a traveler's notebook. I have some other stuff in here is why I'm kind of, um, I only have one notebook in here right now, but you can see there's obviously some extra sleeves. So maybe I'll even put like extra sleeves into one of these or something. I'm not too sure, but I actually use this one. I'm going to put it back in the box um, with the prompts because we have a new month coming up and gosh knows we're going to have to pull it. Ooh, Nelly, I don't know where to start. I'm going to start right here. Okay, this is a um, Filofax Domino. I absolutely love it. It is a patent. Um, I got this one at Goodwill and it is faded. Um, the Filofax Domino was my very first Filofax that I ever had. I absolutely love it. I used to have it in a bigger size. I did sell that one and um, I have a I have an orange one that's not in this pile. It's in my other drawer that you guys saw if you watched my um, planner video. Um, I'm going to let this go. And I'm going to tell you why. Um, well, because I'm not using it. That's why. 
<laughs> I love it. I love the pattern. I, um, I wish the orange was in pattern, the one I have, but, um, this one needs some cleanup and whatnot. So I'll see what I can do to it. And for right now, I'm going to put it in the, like the cell pile because, um, but if not, I'll give it to Goodwill. But, um, the reason I don't reach for it because I like to hold it like this. The reason I don't reach for it is it doesn't sit flat. Like, and I think like with more use, maybe I just don't know. I just don't know, but I don't reach for it. I'm going to let it go. I'm just going to, I'm going to make these decisions knowing I'm going to release things knowing that what I need will be there in the future. That's it. I'll find it again if I need it. Right. Um, this is not a unicorn. It's not like anything. So anyway, I'm going to, this is the first thing to go in the like cell pile, if you will. Okay. This is an A6, um, cover. It is not like a high end brand or anything, but I did really like it. I'm going to keep it for now. Cause again, I don't know. Yeah. I'm just covers. Yeah. Okay. This is a brand new, um, Wonderland 222 notebook with that beautiful Toma River paper in it. Oh gosh, it's just so gorgeous. Lisa does a beautiful job over there. Uh, and I have it in a, um, oops, gel cover. Now, do I want to, let's maybe do that. Let's take off the covers. This is the beautiful notebook. Um, I mean, it has kind of a scratch. I don't care if it gets scratched. I might put stickers on something, but I don't, want to reach for it like this. I like to have them in a cover, but until I use it, I'm going to take it out of the cover and leave it like this. So this is a blank notebook. I'm going to keep the cover, um, mm, right here. Cause I actually had some more, so I'm not too sure where they went. Okay. All right, here we go. Okay. One of the, one of the piles here is actually old planners and I'm not I'm not too sure my thought about it. So I, I, we might need to come back to that, but I'm not, I don't know what I'm doing with those. I don't think I need them anymore. Like I know I don't need them anymore. The question is, do I want them? And some of them I might need like, but I don't think so for tax reasons, but I don't think so. Anyway, let's, let's go through this. This is, um, this is my current, uh, planner cover, which you guys have seen. It has a, I think this is a Dollar Tree notebook in here. You guys, this notebook, um, although it's cream pages and you know, I'm not a cream girl. Um, why is this receipt? Oh, because it has a tax receipt. See, this is this, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Um, okay. Um, this paper is like really, really nice. I mean, it's, I don't know. Anyway, for a dollar fifty or whatever it was, uh, it has some stuff in here, gifts and whatnot, cards from people. Um, I love this cover still, and I'm currently using it with my current planner. So this I'm obviously keeping. Again, I think some of the covers. Okay. Um, well, I guess I'll go through these. I don't know. I'm going to go through this first. Okay. This is my Hobonichi uh, Avec 2020. When I first is that even right? Yeah. When I first, I think found Hobonichi and I decided on the cousin, um, what, what a year, what a year to, <laughs> what a year for journaling. Right. Uh, and for, so the struggle with this is that, and I can't remember, um, I have taken out quite a bit of it. You can see I've cut out pages because I didn't use the daily pages I used. I'm just looking real quickly. Here's a weekly layout, but, uh, that year went, you know, so I did lots of stickers and stuff in here in my weeklies. I might I might keep this to like look at for a minute, but I just don't think I need this. So I'm going to go through it and then I'm going to get rid of it. And by get rid of it, I'm going to um, probably put it in the shredder or whatever. Okay. The binding's coming off and whatnot. I don't think I need this old planner. That's a whole nother pile. I guess we'll make a pile over here. I'm going to try and go through these. So that is the first six months. Here's the second six months. 
I wish you guys could feel this. This is like super small down here at the bottom. Now you can see the pages I didn't use here. I've cut these out and put them in my, you know, unused paper, if you will. So I'm going to go through these. Um, it was kind of a fun year in terms of um, just work and stuff because, um, I mean, everything was on Zoom, right? Um, but again, lots of, I mean, fun, look at fun and this paper. Oh my gosh. It's gorgeous. Um, handles watercolor. There's a fun week vacation, <laughs> but again, like fun, fun. All right. So I'm going to Do you keep your old planners? How long do you keep your old planners for? I'm going to see if I can release those. That's what I'm going to uh, like uh, shred them, get rid of them. Okay, that's the goal. That being said, here's, here's the next year, 2021. Now, I don't know what happened in 2021. But I believe I bought this set late in the year. Like I didn't start the year with it. This is the first half. This is the second half of the year. Um, and you can see I just simply didn't use it. And so then I started um, just maybe playing with stuff. But I didn't use it as a planner. So I don't, I don't know why I bought it. How about that? Um, now this is, now this is, Mm, current on my mind because I'm figuring out what my planner is going to be for 2024. I really, really want to use the personal size ring just because if you watch that video, you know, um, but this, this planner is completely usable. It's completely usable. I could just renumber it. So it's got the monthlies in here. Um, Then obviously the weeklies, I mean, and I would have to, you know, I would have to renumber it, but remember I'm kind of, you know, doing that anyway, like, right. Not, not for the sake of renumbering, but, um, trying to find that, that spread again, but we're putting washy and yummy stuff up there anyway. So this planner set, I would, I would take this cover sheet off. I, I decorated this on a piece of paper and then glued it on. So this is removable because I would want to save this and obviously put a different cover on, right? So this is actually an option for next year. So we're definitely saving that. Okay. This is a little, um, just, that's like my YouTube picture thing. I need to change that probably. Uh, this is just an empty notebook that I haven't used in a while. I'm going to save it. I love it. This was on clearance at Michael's. I've shown these to you before and I just covered it and was playing with it. Um, so we'll save this because it's usable. All right. Here is a planner cover. Oh, look, 2021. This was my planner in 2021. Great. There he goes. Um, why did I save this? Well, uh, I can tell you why, but I'm going to let it go. I'm going to put it in the trash if I can get this guy off. Um, I saved it because I thought, Oh, that's still really sticky. That's a good sticker. Um, where do you put that? Dear goodness. Super sticky. Okay. I saved this because I thought it would make a great journal cover like for a monthly journal specifically October, which is weird because we're coming up on October. Um, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to trash it. It's going in the trash, you guys, in the trash, which I also have right under my desk and it's empty. Okay. Here is a Moleskine journal. I bought it, I'm sure, at um, the thrift store. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about this. This one's hard. So <laughs> I'm moving it over here. 
okay, here is a bunch. I can't show you any more than this. This is a bunch of Happy Meal. I'm going to go through these, um, take them out of their envelopes, make sure I have all the um, addresses in my, in my Happy Meal address book. And if there's still stuff in here that I can save, I'm going to put it into my Happy Mail book. But this I will reduce and not put in this drawer anymore. It will go um, into a project pile if that if that makes sense. I need to I need to clean up my Happy Mail situation. All right, so that's an easy one. Um, here is <laughs> here's when we were making zines. This was one of the zines I sent out. Oh my goodness, that was fun. What do, what do we do with this? What do we do with this? I don't even know. Okay. I, I'm like shifting it over there. Okay. Here is another, oh, um, you know, traveler's notebook. Is this the same? I'm not too sure. No, I don't think it is. I was seeing if it was this. No. And it's even a different size. Okay. Um, I don't know what brand this is. If it's a brand where I bought it, I don't remember anything. Gosh, it is just yummy though. It's real leather. That's gorgeous. It's got a couple elastics in it, plastic sleeves. So I'm going to put it in my save pile for now. I'm not, uh, okay. First of all, I don't like this. It's too thin, but I will, I'll put it over here for now. It might have carried stuff like this. Okay, this is a planner from what year? Great. And weirdly enough, it, oh yeah, the, okay. I covered it. I've been through this with you guys before. This is a Webster's page. I really liked this system. Um, I've shown it to you before. I'm trying to find another page. Um, oh, this is 2019. I can tell from what's on here. Um, I mean, they're not great pages, but uh, very, so vertical weeks, right? Vertical weeks. Um, so stinking cute. Okay. Very weird though. It has 39 weeks in it. I've, I've vented all this to you before. Um, um, there's a fly in my room. How weird is that? Uh, I don't think I need this. So I'm going to put it, I'm going to put it, I know I don't need it. I'm going to put it with my, um, other planners that I'm going to go through. I just want to make sure if there's like any little notes I wrote in here, um, I'm just going to do a very thorough once over with it and make sure I get out of here what I want. Um, and then I'm going to let it go. Look right there. What's that? My favorite punch. Um, I, I don't even think I'll try and save this cover. I was trying to think like, should we try and save the cover just to use it like as a journaling card or something? So we might do that. I'm going to go through this and get rid of it. Yeah. Look at that guy. Is he not cute? Okay. Yep. I'm going to, I'm going to get rid of it, which means I'm not going to do flip throughs of these ever again in my life. How about that? Okay. Here is the other part of that. Oh my goodness. Do you guys hear the fly? See the fly? My goodness. Okay. This is the other part of that system. This is also the Webster's pages. Um, yeah. Okay. This is interesting. Okay. This is a month. These are months. Um, I'm trying to look here's September of 2021. I mean, 2019, excuse me. <laughs> and I am so determined that I don't like this weekly layout that I just ignored the whole thing and used it as notes. So this is a month and a week in this book. Um, 
but a different a horizontal layout. So again, I'm going to go through these. Sometimes I write like a bunch of um, quotes and stuff in here. Yeah, this is when I went to my conference. So there's some there's some quotes in here I might keep. Uh, so I will do the same thing. I'll clean it out. Now this cover, you know, literally just came off. So we will probably cut this apart. Um, I really like, you know, this quote. That's why I put it on there. I might try and save something, but uh, I'm going to put it in that pile. We will get rid of it. Here is a pocket. We'll just put this with pockets, uh, foldable pockets. It can go into my journal. Okay, here is the third book of that series. It's another Webster's Pages and... Yeah, it's more weeklies, horizontal weeklies. I don't, I don't know why, but look, oh my God, I loved, oh, I loved this so much. <laughs> I mean, but look at you guys, if you have watched my other planner videos, you know, this is the exact, almost the exact layout I chose for my work planner. This is how my brain works. I'm very clear about that. Um, there is a to do at, um, you know, the top, there's a hourly layout. And then my weekend here is stacked because, um, we have less going on or, or more going on if you will, but it's like all day soccer or all day sailing or what, like whatever, but I don't need the hourly obviously. So this was the layout. I love it. I really, really love this layout. Um, yeah. Interesting. Um, I mean, but there's like, Christmas week. Look how stinking cute that is. Um, I don't know. Oh, so cute. I mean, is this why we keep them? Is this why we keep them? So we can look at these cute things. Um, yeah, this is the end of 2019. Oh my gosh. I wasn't using this planner, obviously. Look how stinking cute it is. Dang. Um, I don't know if I've already moved into another planner or why, because this is very blank is very strange. I don't know. So anyway, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to cut it apart. I, but gosh, it's fun to look at. It's fun to look at, but I'm going to let it go. I don't want to hold it in my, I, uh, I feel like the feng shui and energy flow is off when everything is just so stuffed in those drawers and I can't ever go through them. Here's the other thing. Um, I'm in a little bit of a Swedish death cleansing, whatever you call it. Uh, my father passing this year has been extremely difficult. And um, if I were to die today uh, or tomorrow, I, I don't, I don't want other people to have to go through stuff like this that I could have clearly done. I mean, there is, there is an element of that in my brain. Okay. And I'm hoarding it. Like I'm just holding onto it for what reason I need to figure that out. Okay. Here is a hello today. And is this a carpe diem? brand. Don't know if that's what, um, I'm going to let it go. I don't know. I'm just going to send it to the thrift store. Okay. Here's another little notebook set I bought. Super cute lined. Um, I used to do my process journal. Well, I do do my process journaling usually unlined, but I used to grab a bunch of these. Um, also for work, I used to use a lot of these and I simply don't need them anymore. Both of these are going uh, to the thrift store. Okay. All right. Here is a cute little poppy flower. I ordered this. Wow. Years ago. Um, little traveler's notebook. Super cute. I put some tape here. Oh, it has our weekly in it. No, I don't know what that is. Day something. Checklist location, weather, and some grid paper. This book is plain. No lined and a contact list of some sort. Not too sure. Uh, it's got like a nice 
made myself a little note, like what size inserts are here. Uh, I'm going to let this go. I'm going to see if I can just like, I don't know, list it somewhere and just sell it for a little bit. I really like it. I, I mean, but I haven't used it. Stationary designed. Yeah. Super cute. All right. Selling that one. Okay. Here comes part of the hard part, friends. I'm letting you know what's in this drawer and what's in the next drawer. Um, I was a happy planner girl. I've been an everything girl. Don't get me wrong. Like Erin Condren, Hobonichi, happy planner, Webster, any of it. I've tried it all. Um, and for a while I really coveted these gold, <laughs> um, discs. And I bought a lot of old planners or on sale planners just for the discs. Um, I always use the paper. You guys know I cut up, up all the paper inside and try and use it, but I don't carry like a happy planner anymore, nor will I like, I don't. Yeah. So I'm going to let it go. It's probably, it's probably going to the thrift store. I'm just going to check one of the Facebook sites just to see if people want the discs or what, like what, what's happening there. Oh, here's another one of those lined. That was a three set. Okay. So that's going to the thrift store. Whoops. With the other ones. Here is a, Hmm. I know what's in here. Um, oh yeah, here's, whoops. Here's a happy mail envelope I'll put with the others. And then here we had lots of zines and received and the ones I made. <laughs> super fun. That was super fun when we did this. Um, not sure what to do with them. I guess I could mail them out in happy mail and I don't need this cover. So, um, I guess I'll, oh, look, that one's from Megan. Oh my gosh. So much fun. Um, so what I want to do with that, um, I've totally cut that up and used it in my journal. So, uh, I don't know, maybe we'll send these out in happy mail or keep one. I, I guess that's what I try to do. I don't know this. I'm going to keep this. I'm going to release and I'm, I'm simply going to I think just give it to the thrift store. Someone made this. Um, I don't know. We'll see. All right. These I'm not too sure about. So they, my pile of not sure and to finish later is way big right now. Is that me just procrastinating or what is that? All right. All right. What's next? Okay. Let's do this. This is a Aaron. No, this is, oh, a happy life planner. I just took the things off. Obviously here's the rings. Now these are plastic not metal. And Stephanie actually signed this for me when I went to the planner convention. And oh my gosh, um, this was definitely my first happy planner. I'm pretty sure really loved it. Uh, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to go through it, make sure there's nothing in here I need. Um, but I even had fun like cutting up paper and putting it in there. Um, I'm just trying look how fun look how fun that is um but see like these I will take out and use that's you know I use those all the time you've seen me do that so um gosh friends this is I don't even know what year what what are we on here I don't even know 2016 so this was our first year after we moved um, gosh, this just has my heart. Like I remember making these pages and, um, I mean, look how stinking cute. All right. We're going to do it. We're going to go through it and cut it up and release those discs is what we're going to do. <laughs> All right. Here is an Erin Condren. This is... Um, a cover I bought. If you have never done Erin Condren, they had these, um, they might still, I haven't done Erin Condren in many years. They had the coil binding and then these covers you could buy either from Erin Condren or from other people. And so this one I bought like off eBay or whatever. Um, do we know what year this is? I mean, I've got all sorts of st sticky notes in here. Uh, <laughs> Oh, 2016, it looks like. 16, 17. 
Okay, so it was like the end of 16 and I used it for 2017. So it's got 2017 in here. Um, again, stickers and uh, I can't imagine. I will go through and maybe take out um, some quotes, you know, off those sheets and... I mean, like, you know, that is savable. Um, yeah, but the rest I'm going to cut up and let go. I glued in habit trackers that I never habit tracked on. <laughs> um, I'm going to, I'm going to cut it up and okay. I'm going to also take off the covers because that is a separate thing. And... Okay, I'm going to put the cover back on <laughs> just for right now. Uh, this is what I'm talking about. On the inside of that, there is like um, personal information and stuff that I want to save and transfer into another notebook. I probably already have it in my other notebook. I just want to make sure. So this one's going in the um, take apart, take apart pile. And here is another Erin Condren. I already took the cover off of this one. Um like dashboards and stuff you can order. Let's see. Oh, 2014, 15. Um, this is like old school. Look at this. Oh, this is 10 years ago. I don't need my planner from 10 years ago. Um, I think I was using this for, I don't even know. Don't even know. Um, this one is, is, I, I'm not even too sure. I don't even know what I use this one for. I'll have to go through it and see. It's got some paper here. Oh, this was our um, Days of Christmas um, cleaning list. <laughs> that was fun. Um, yeah, there you go. There's a beautiful week. This is the day we moved from California to Washington, right here. On We partied all night long. We I stayed up all night with like 28 um, elementary school kids <laughs> or sixth grade, uh, first year of, um, anyway, it doesn't matter. And, um, and we, we left, we drove this morning to Washington. But isn't that fun? Don't need it. Okay, I'm going to undo this one and get rid of it, throw it out. So we're making, we're making progress. Okay, here we go. Here's bags. Um, this, it, I mean, like it's been loved. It's just a pencil pouch and we're going to release it. These are the same. This one's cleaner. I'm going to release it. I'm going to release that. They're going to the thrift store. Okay. Oh, this one I like a lot. Um, do I use it? Why don't I use it? Gosh. Um, I don't know why I don't use it. I'm going to keep it for now. I don't have to get rid of everything. I'm getting rid of lots of stuff. I'm doing a good job. Ooh, this I'm going to keep. I will flatten it out, but I think this is like, yeah, totally usable. Um, you know, to keep a theme of stuff in, i.e. sailing, i.e. whatever uh, here. Yeah. So keeping that for sure. Oh, here's another one. This one goes in a binder. I wonder if... Um, hmm, that's interesting. Um, tell you what. My Happy Mail bucket's covered. I'm going to put that in Happy Mail. I love these. Now, ironically, I don't use them very much because I don't know why, but I'm keeping them because I love them. Okay. Oh, this one is so dang cute. It has this little latch and this button and look at the front. Okay, that's going to the thrift store. I haven't used it in many years. All right, here's another planner. I got this. Um, this is a Michael's Recollections. <laughs> I am sure. Okay, here. Mm, okay, here's. So it has books in it. No, it does not. I put the books in it. Okay, this cover. Yeah, I don't need. 
Um, I'm going to give this to the thrift store. I'm going to put... I might have taken the cover off this. I'm not too sure. That's white paper. This is just brown paper. Um, am I going to use this for what? I just had a note on there. 25 full spreads. So if I'm going to use this, it's not going to be enough for a month. I'm going to have to add to it. Um, this one's brown. I'm going to put these in here. And... I, I don't know. I'm going to release, well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to save these for now. Just because I have more coming and I'm going to put them all together. Okay. This is going to the thrift shop. This tie I took off and it's staying with me. Okay. Fair, fair enough. All right. Let's do, we're doing good on covers. All the things. This was just a blue sky. I really liked this one. That's interesting. Um, this is a nice traveler's notebook. Um, let me just see very quickly. I don't think it's the right size. Where's the notebooks we kept? It's not, it's not this size. It is this size, but it's not. So it's not big enough for the A5. Um, does that mean... This is the B6, yes? It's like too big for the B6. Um, I'm going to I'm going to give it to the thrift store. Yeah. Okay. We're cooking now. Oh gosh, I loved this one. Um This is an Echo Park. Oh, it smells good. Echo Park. All right, more plastic sleeves. So I'm going to take, well, I might as well leave it in here. I guess it doesn't matter. And then it still has just a white notebook in here. Mm, this one's harder. This one is harder. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm going to let it go. See if I can sell it. Okay. All right, keep going, Allison, keep going. You're doing great. This little guy is what? Paper Studio. So this is from uh, Hobby Lobby. I should keep it because I don't have a Hobby Lobby near me anymore. <laughs> I don't think, again, though, they're not going to hold. I mean, they're not an A5 size. They're not going to fit this for sure. And they're too big for the B6. Now, it would fit like a journal like this guy that we started with, I think. It's not meant for this. I mean, these straps are not meant for this. But it does have this pocket here. So does that fit in there? I could cut off the strap. Let's just see if it fits. No, it's not in the mood. It's not going to fit that either. Okay. Um, this is probably close to the size I'm using right now, isn't it? It sure is. Hmm. Well, I mean, the one I'm using right now obviously doesn't have, it's not meant to be a traveler's notebook. It, it's meant, you know, for the slide in pockets but it is essentially the same size. Um, well, I'll see. I, I'm going to let it go. I see if somebody wants that. Okay. Mm, old planner. This is, uh, 2022. This is Wonderland 222. Um, I loved this planner. Hmm. Look at that month. I really enjoyed this size. But um, 
Pepsi here, not, but again, guys, I mean, let's just, yeah, I so badly want to be a weekly girl, but this is like how my brain works, but I just simply highlighted here my work hours. I didn't, and then anything other than that, I wasn't really using it like to go to the market or do the things or, I mean, I'm trying to think, yeah, we're not using it. I'm using it to use my stickers. I mean, some of them are used more. So I have my to do's down here. Um, so I'm going to do the same thing. You guys, I'm going to let it go now. Look, I wasn't even using the trackers. <laughs> Like I tried, I tried. Um, there's July's tracker. I don't, I don't know. Gosh, why didn't I use that? Okay. Yeah, I need to think about that. I'm going to do the same thing though. You guys, I'm going to take it apart. Wow. Okay. I'm willing to let go of all those. I just need to make sure it doesn't have like anything I need for taxes, I guess is my thing. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is a passion planner from what year? Oh my gosh. Look at all this stuff in here. What year? Uh, 2014, 15, it looks like. Let's see. Boy, this is when it started. <laughs> this is when it started. Definitely. If you're not familiar with the, yeah, I mean, loved it. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Just a weekly view. Um, let's see. They have a monthly view, don't they? Yes, they have a monthly view. That's silly. Um, why? Where? Where's the monthly view? Probably where the tape is. Um, yeah, this this one got lots of use. Um So here's a month. Um, I can tell you it's September cause it's, um, red, yellow, and green <laughs> with apples, <laughs> but didn't use it. Right. So, Oh, that was a good planner. I love this planner. It's soft. Oh gosh. Mm. Okay. I'm going to let it go. Same deal. Okay. This was the end of 2015. So, you know, the other planner, I was double dipping, trying to transfer over. Mm -hmm. Yep. This is the last week. This is when we moved. Yep. Moved. Yep. Okay. Crazy. Going to let it go. We're going to release it. We're going to say goodbye. All right. This is a fun cover. Oh, I like this one a lot. Um, mm, this is a tough one. We're going to let it sit there for a minute. <laughs> ah, these are all the same. These are from Michael's. Um, they're pretty soft. I'm pretty sure they're not real leather. Um, and it has the sticker on it. That's probably not appropriate, but, um, there we go. Um, yeah, I'm going to let it go. Again, knowing, knowing if I need it, it'll be there. Now, see these, these would fit if you wanted to pop another site, like a journal in here, uh, you could. Very nicely, actually, now that I'm looking at it. <laughs> um, and you could also put you know, a smaller thing in here, like envelopes or something. But I mean, it's not, it's not, it's pulling these strings, right? But it is a nice cover, but I'm going to, I'm going to let it go. I, I, again, I don't use it. I don't, I'm going to give it to the thrift store. Whew. Um, okay. My thrift bag is big. I really like this one. Um, now this is the same. Whoops. 
this is the same brand. This is the same um, series, if you will. I think this is the Illustrated Faith or whatever. This one we have my, um, you know, stamped pieces in. You can see how this is worn. Um, like, do I want to replay? I feel like I want to keep this one. I just, um, for right now, I, I might be adding some stuff. So, or like using it to hold. Okay. Let's just keep it. I don't have to. Yeah. All right. We're doing good. Here is a Ranger. Oh, this is a Diane Reevely. Oh my gosh. I love this. Um, hmm. I don't know you guys. I need to use this for something. It is like hard paper. I've ripped some of it out, used it. This is one of her art. Um, hmm. There's not enough in here and I wouldn't use it for a monthly. Like it's too, this needs to be like an art journal. Okay. Saving that one. Here is another one of the covers from Michaels. Oh gosh, I love this green. Okay, I'm letting it go to the thrift store. I, I had to like let it go because I was gonna keep it. I was gonna keep it. Okay, we are already at 46 minutes. Uh, I feel like I have not made a dent, but we have, but we have, but we have. Okay. Let's move the pile. So we may have a little bit better view. This one's a blank one. I'm putting it over there. Okay. This pile's hard. Let's do a different pile. I, I'm not ready. I'm not emotionally prepared for that. All right. Oh, here's my other covers. So I started without you. Um, here are my jelly covers for, um, two A sixes and B six. I don't know. doesn't matter. Here are my jelly covers. I'm obviously keeping these. Um, yeah, here is a Hobonichi cover for an A six, which I love. It has a beautiful pocket on the back. It's been covered. Um, when I used it, I'll probably put it back in the cover once I decide, but I wanted to get it out. I'm not, I'm going to keep that. Don't know. Uh, here is a, um, whatever cheap brand of um, an a6 it's got like a i don't know what it is plasticky kind of it's a little cushiony uh i had this on this little guy this kinbor mm, i don't know what year it was 2022 i didn't use it and in trying to decide what 2025 is going to look like for me, I went and revisited. And so this guy right now is just a notebook for me. I take it to work. Um, it's working great. It's working swimmingly. I took out all the monthlies that I did kind of use, and it just had monthlies and dailies. And so um, this is just beautiful paper, and I'm just using it as a notebook. So this is obviously I'm keeping, and I probably don't even want in that pile, to be honest. Okay, that's just on my desk every day right now. Oh, look at this, you guys. I found this. Okay. This is where it started. Look at this planner. It's a... Oh. You guys, look at this. It's so cute. My son wrote me, like, a little note. It says, hi, Mom. Hope you guys are having fun. We love you. Um, okay. I have a little quote card in there. It is just a cheap, cheap, but look, it even has like an annual planner in it. I pulled it because it's a monthly view only. This is how it started. And I, <laughs> 2012, 2012, a bad attitude is like a flat tire. You can't go anywhere until you change it. There you go. This is like um, a card from Melody Ross. This is some of my scrapbooking stuff. It just, it's like a Dollar Tree planner. I'm not, I'm sure it is. I, yeah. 
Yep. So pretty cool. I'm going to take it apart. I'm going to see if I can salvage any part of this. Same deal, but I wanted to show you that. I just think it's hilarious. Okay. Let's go through this little bag of yumminess. This is actually a purse um, insert. It was all the rage back in the day and it actually snaps, but I leave this in my drawer as kind of a, a holder divider thing. So um, that's not going anywhere. All right, here's some blank paper. I don't even know what that fits. Well, it fits something because, okay, here's pockets that it also fits. So I must have a planner somewhere that that fits. Here's some blank. I'm, I'm giving all of this away. I'm just going to, uh, I'm going to leave it right here in case we find a planner it fits and I'll put it in there. Uh, here's some Ziploc bags. I don't, you know, because this is, uh huh, but pretty cool size. You can tell uh, they're like journal size. And so I had them in there, but so I will take these out to my happy mail table actually, because I have stuff like kind of out there in packages. Oh my gosh. This is my favorite Erin Condren planner cover I ever bought. This is from 07. Always be yourself unless you can be a mermaid. Then always be a mermaid. Is that not amazing? Look at that artwork. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to put that in the cell pile. Just, I don't even know if I, I don't even know. Um, oh my goodness. Here's a picture. <laughs> oh my goodness. 1997. I, I don't even know. 1997 pictures of my husband and I. I think I'm going to start a new journal or um, these are what? Day Runner. I'm going to give all of this away. It, um, daily. That's a pretty cool layout, actually. I mean, that's a pretty cool layout. Um, that's, I, I actually really like this layout. I was actually looking at a printable, um, that was very similar to this. So it had like to do's and an hourly. And then this site is blank. This is, uh, Franklin Covey. Yeah. 1997. Um, but it's not dated. Like it's not, it doesn't say Thursday. Right. So it's just, that's cool. Let's see. Master task list. Yeah. Okay, great. I'm going to give all of that away again. I'm just waiting on a holder. Okay. I'm not ready. I'm just not ready to give this guy away. I waited a long time to get it. It is a personal size, um, six ring. Is this personal size? Yeah. Compact. I don't know. Um, I'm, I'm just not ready to give it away. So we'll keep it for now. It's okay. It's okay. Now this, I'm going to try and sell. It is brand new and I bought it. Um, had to have it. This is Elizabeth craft designs and it's a very cool idea. Like the rings come through the cover. Just not too sure. Um, Oh, and that just came off. That's kind of a bummer. I thought it just undid, but I don't know how that, hmm. Well, that's kind of a bummer. Um, it came with this die set to make planner pages. Yeah, and here's a planner page I made. Here's the stuff I made. Mmm, that stinks like plastic. All right, so it had, I well, made a fun tag. It has this little date thing, but this goes in the rings like this, kind of fun. Um, oh, these actually pop out. This is like, uh, they cut through. See that? 
this is on like um, sticker paper, if you will, that she sells. Here's a fun punch or die. And whoops. And here's the little die holder. No, hole things, protectors, hole protectors. There should be probably another one. Here it is. Here's another one. And then these were the pages. Um, there's another ring, two rings. Um, yeah, see, and then we put them on. I mean, that's fun smush paper, right? Um, yeah, I don't know. Do I need any of this? Probably not. Do I want to keep this? Probably not. I'm going to sell all of this, unless I want to keep this as like, well, we'll keep these. I, nobody wants this. Uh, I'm going to sell this. I don't know about this strap, to be honest. I'm, that's lame, but whatever. I'm going to put it in the sell pile. Okay. That's that. This little pile of yumminess can go, well, we'll put it right here for right now. All right. Here's a cover for the passion planner, which I absolutely love. That was one of the planners that I showed you. Um, well, here's the one, obviously I used this blue one. I put pen, glued a pen thing on here. That's an Erin Condren pen holder. Um, but it would also hold like other journals, right? It's pretty tight, but, and if it wasn't hardcover, you could definitely get it in here. I'm going to release it. I'm going to send them both to the thrift store and someone else can enjoy them. I really liked them. They're super soft and yeah. So we'll see about that. Okay. This one is a key. No. What is this one? I thought this was a something. Kiki K or something. This one holds journals beautifully. Yeah. Even, yeah. Um, really pretty. Um, I don't think I need it because am I using it? I'm not. Um, Mm, it's a maybe it's a maybe do I have something else I don't know you guys I don't I'm gonna okay thrift store all right I'm doing good this is a happy planner giveaway notebook giveaway I don't even know I will find other stuff that that goes together and I'll put them all in a bag <gasps> this is my planner that my husband my cover that my husband gave me that's wood that's amazing um, heck yeah. I loved this cover. It just was like, right, heavy, but, um, but it's kind of cool when you don't have anything like it's, it's actually kind of fun to travel with. Cause this serves as like almost, you know, a cool desk. It is big for even this, um, cousin. And this is what I had in it. Something of this nature, right? Um, it wasn't for a planner. It's like for a notebook. Oh my gosh. Hmm. That makes me happy. It didn't have a lot of, um, give to it, obviously, but I'm totally keeping this. I absolutely love it. Um, yeah. So we're keeping that. All right. This is a beautiful look at this. You guys, you want to smell it? I mean, it's handmade leather. It's gorgeous. Oh, look at here's the notebook. <coughs> Excuse me, Kiki K. This is the notebook uh, that went with that blue cover. Yeah, it is Kiki K. Um, very small lines. Yep, I'm releasing that with the cover. I'll put it inside the cover. Um, this was a gift this year for Christmas from a dear friend and I love it so much. Uh, let's try out oh, this fits in here. 
Yeah, it does. Oh, you guys, does it fit? It does not. Is it all the way in? I saw someone else do this. Hold on. But it certainly wouldn't hold it if, if this guy became any fatter. And y'all know that these books become fat. Um, I saw someone else have a problem with a planner. Oh, well, this one you can flip over. Would that make a difference? And for whatever reason, it fit if she put it in the front cover but not the back. I don't know. But this one doesn't matter because it's reversible. So maybe... But again, it wouldn't hold it if I bulked this guy up at all. No, it still doesn't fit. It's still short. Um, I'm not too sure. I, I guess it would stretch a little bit. I mean, it's leather, but it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm keeping it. Oh, gosh, it's gorgeous. The embossing and coloring on here is stunning. Okay, keeping that. This is, um, this is my old cover. For the cousin this is what I had um, my cousin in and I also had a plastic um, jelly cover on it and that's what I carried um, yeah I would probably I would probably well I would I would redo the stickers and whatnot but we're gonna keep this one it's my only yeah we're gonna keep this I I'll, you know I'll redo all this okay keep this is another leather look at look at that you guys I mean look at the yumminess it's too big for no it's not it fits this one perfect this is the one we we tried right again I would take the well it doesn't matter just flip it over I would take the band off um oh it's a little tight but again I think it would stretch I really do um I think this might work. We could probably work on it a little bit and get it in here and it would fit. Oh gosh, that's gorgeous. I mean, it's a little big on the, but it's, I mean, just delightful. Okay. Keeping that, this is, oh my gosh, this is, oh, this is the journal my sister handmade for me. This is all out of an old purse. This is all out of an old purse that she deconstructed and re-sewed. Um, and then she made this journal for me and I'm gonna take it out just so you can see it. But look at, in my favorite season. And she went and found white Tomo River paper and look at the signature she sewed in you guys look at the book she she is so incredibly talented look look at the signatures on this book is that not crazy um yeah and then look at this bookmark she made so talented and I can't use it like I can't, I don't, I, I can't, I can't use it. And so it sits in my drawer because I can't use it. All right, here's an A6. This is 2023 planner. I will do the same thing. I'm going to go through it. Uh, this is another Wonderland. I absolutely loved it. This was a weekly, a monthly and a weekly. And this one I did use. Um, I'm not, actually, I'm not going to get rid of this. This is just last year and I, but Mm, whatever. I'll put it in the planner pile to go through. I'll pull what I can from it. I don't need things from it. Um, yeah. So let's call it done. We're, I have a whole nother drawer plus all of this. So this will be part one of my planner journal D stash. Let me know your thoughts. Is this crazy? I mean, like, I feel like it's crazy when I go through my own stuff and I see how much I have. I feel like it's crazy, but again, it's been years and years of accumulating things. So I'm ready to let it go. And, um, yeah, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts. And, um, yeah, I appreciate your feedback. And I just like, would you have kept, do you keep your old planners? And if so, for how long? That's really the question. This other stuff is kind of extra, like blank journals and whatnot that, you know, I just need to make a choice on whether or not I'd use or not, but 
do you keep your old planners? I, I feel like I've kept them for a long time. So let me know your thoughts. I hope you're well. I hope you are doing something creative, whether that's cleaning or creating or just relaxing. I hope you're doing something that brings you joy today. And I hope you find something today that inspires you. Take care.